Welcome back to the Rhino Talk Show. This is your boy Rhino. Today I'm here at Moreza. That's the prototype. That's the prototype for the Africa's. I don't want to brag, but South Africa's first uh, vehicle, or should I say Southern Africa, because I know some few brands that are affiliated with themselves in, uh, in, 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 in other Western countries, uh, uh, some East Africa, something like that, but I'm not going to mention their name. But I'm here in Santen at the. This is the primary. This is a prototype. This is actually a prototype. So, yeah, here is where it gets interesting. This car is still the prototype, it's not the finished version, so you're not gonna have to judge. And it's an African first. When I mean Africa, I mean Africa. Literally, the seats in that car are made in South Africa. Guys do the seats, guys do this. But if you know about cars and you understand something, is every car that you know on the market has a different uh, has a different component that has to be taken from somewhere. So all cars, when you say made in Africa, all of you are gonna say, nah, did he make his seat in Africa? Did he make this in Africa? Did he do this in Africa? But yeah, but basically most of the thing. It's more, at this point, I think 60 40. 60 percent, uh, 60 40 split because of the cost and stuff like that. But I'm gonna sit down with the CEO. Let me not just rush and tell you guys, but I'm gonna tell you, I'll take you around the car and let's look at the car. Uh, so this is a prototype from Rail. This is a 1.5, 87 kilowatt, 87 kilowatt, I think. That's the kilowatt for this car. And this is the engine. It's powered by Mega, uh, Mega Motor. That's a Mega Motor engine. But uh, you've seen this in some female film brand but however the, the the this car is manufactured like that i'm saying it's, it's it's an african brand there's a ceo right there we're gonna sit down with him and we're gonna look like i'll say what caught my caught my eye is those tires were made specifically for this car these tires are made in south africa they are specific for this car so it's 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 something that we we, we, we i'm actually uh, astonished of especially from a guy who we're gonna hear his story the car is still a prototype so there is few hiccups then because this is not the final product so they're still doing this was made the dashboard for this car was made here in south africa uh he's gonna mention names i'm gonna shout out the dashboard uh the seats were made here uh the engine remember engines uh there's no there's no company that says i do my own engine there's no company that does say i do this sometimes you have to source on every vehicle that you can ever think of uh this is the moreza it's called the moreza primate uh which is gonna be Available on the market very soon. I'm just gonna go around. Just hold on, just gonna around. But I like it. It comes with this. These are standard Moreza Max. These are standard Moreza Max uh, that are also gonna be coming with the vehicle. The engine is. So Moreza is partnering, currently partnered with Safer. I just want the CEO to say this to you because I don't wanna say anything off guard for a new brand. Very essential for someone to be honest about it and to tell you the truth about the car. So. So 1.587 kilowatt, it will come with CVT. Uh, this one is a prototype. So when I mean prototype, it's very important for you guys to know that this is not a finished product. The finished product might have, have more stuff. So this is just to enter level to get it certified in South Africa, which we're gonna sit down. He's not the first uh, guy to, 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 to do a vehicle in South Africa that I've seen, but he's the one I've seen go all the way to legalize it and make it a brand and try to make a platform to make other ones. I've seen uh, Moses Ngobeni and uh, I've seen uh, Mr. George, uh, I'm sorry I can't pronounce his name, but I've seen his car and I'm going to be seeing those guys very soon to talk about their cars and invention and what they think about Moreza. This is a primate. Uh, let's go inside. Let's just go inside. Let's go inside. So we are going to drive. I'm going to let him drive because it's a prototype. I'm, I know how to drive, but I'm just afraid because it's still the same time. This dashboard was made here. Uh, let's see what, 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 what Android platform is this. But this is how the, 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 this car is gonna come through. Uh, that's the cluster. It is automatic, it's got your drive park. And luckily, let me just see if I can tell how many kilometers. So this is still a prototype, guys. So as an African, as an Af it's got date, it's got time. Uh, I'm just gonna use the other hand so that you guys can see properly. It can show you how many doors are open. That's the time, that's the trip. What else, what else can I see on a prototype? Let me see if I can control the radio from here. Maybe not yet. Or maybe I don't know how to use it. Oh, I can. What was the volume? Did I just put the volume down? There. Because you see, she says prototype. Here it's supposed to be an airbag. I don't know if it's going to be. See it is. Yes. Now, when you look in the car, let's see if that's the multimedia navigation system. So it will come with a navigation system. Down there is the aircon on that. This is sideways. Well, still the past the CEO is always on up in hand as you can see him right there he's 
he's never dressed in suit. He's not a suit guy. <laughs> and let's see if I can, I can, I can use other stuff. Wow, that's cool. So this car is gonna be the end base price of this car is gonna be around one hundred thirty-five thousand. I'm sure. <laughs> I'm getting myself one because this is very good. Uh, basic info, dynamics. That shit has tire pressure. Let's let's let's. Wow, wow. There's high pressure. There's temperature. Oh, there's a lot of technology. So the reason this car is gonna be pretty much cheap is because he's saying some of his parts are done uh, locally, and uh, uh, so there's no reason for the price for that car to be expensive. It's just gonna be uh, as a reasonably priced for everyone to come drive it auto and manual. But I want to take a drive. Let's take a drive, guys. Let's look at it. Let's see, and we're gonna sit down with the CEO. It's gonna be a, le a short uh, interview. But I do want to open the boot space. Oh, okay, I didn't manage. So the boot space also has this. I haven't seen this. I don't know if it's. That's the water for the wiper for the wipers at the back. So I'm guessing the. Also comes the spare wheel right there. Uh, and then. Let's see. Uh, that's the brand. Comes also with the. So guys, uh, welcome in. I'm now with the CEO, the founder, the man himself. That's Mr. Uh, Tatenda Mungofa. He's the one who's going to tell us about this vehicle. But before I ask, because I, I want him to, I don't, I don't want to talk to him much. I want to be asking. But apparently this car is going to be available on the market next, sometime next year. And it's going to come. And the, what's staggering is the price. So are you saying this car is going to be around 135? But, but before, before he answers, look at this, guys. This car is going to have this. For me, this is BMW stuff. This German stuff. This I've never seen. Like I'm only speaking. I drive GM, GMDs, which is Japanese vehicles. Look at this. I can't even use this. So this oil data is gonna come on the vehicle. All this data is gonna come. All uh, this is gonna. All this mileage and stuff. You know what, Bezo? This is um, an African product. Mm -hmm. African people have got an attention to detail. So myself as a designer, we decided to to package within the vehicle things that we think were basic. Mm -hmm. People need to know the oil level in the car. So we don't have that on our cluster. We started to put it on the task. Um, I'm just going to do a brief uh, uh, presentation. Okay. So we've got satellite navigation in the car. So in case your car uh, probably is misplaced uh -huh. or someone says to borrow it without your permission, okay. you always have uh, a combination of the GPS, which you can link to your Google account on the vehicle so it, the same way you miss your laptop and google tells you that your laptop is somewhere else we can do that well we haven't connected it to the, to the internet so this thing's got wi-fi also it's got wi-fi <laughs> so you can connect to the wi-fi which is a basic necessity i mean wi-fi is like oxygen in, in this day so hence we are saying you can pinpoint wherever your car is you don't necessarily need mm -hmm. to add on track google will do that for you for free so those are value adds. So you've got your navigation. You can connect your phone uh, via Bluetooth. Wow. So, so so my phone is already uh, connected. connected yeah. You can have your, your call history. Uh, any looks show you. So. I haven't I, I haven't dialed anyone I know one today. Do I have to tell someone for for me to? to, to I can see the the it says Tatenda. Actually, you can see the. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I, okay. We we'll do that a bit later. Um, and obviously the card information. Okay. Right now, I just want to, to play a bit of music. Okay. Uh, I'm insane to I'm a piano. Okay. So you're going to play, I'm a piano, something. Because this guy in something. This is actually, the head office is in something. So, look at this. While he's looking for the music, guys. Look at that. I love this cluster. I love this cluster. Uh, 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 let, let me pair it again. Paired now. We're we paired now. We're we playing from the phone, uh, something. Uh, this is a prototype, guys. That's one yeah. thing. So, so you have just steering controls or you can just go the touch screen. It's got a bit of bass on it. I like my music. That's a system. It's got adaptive cruise control so you can control all of that all of that from, from here. From yeah. the screen. At some point I think the music will turn off because we're in the basement. Okay. Now also for my for for our, for us let's just kill it down. Because okay. for our for copyright sorry guys, for copyright, let's leave that on out. But listen to so you are saying this dashboard was made in South Africa. So this is basically a South African product. And you are saying something 
uh, earlier on and which we we're gonna hear in this in the interview just 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 tell me something about the about the dashboard about the interior are you 100 percent on or, or, or uh, it's done and this was designed all this design is yours no two cars in south africa have got this so if you go into any spare shop or any place where they sell components yes. you will never find it because um, this was designed in-house uh -huh. uh, at Moreza uh -huh. um, the, the dashboard with the, with the touch screen it's uh -huh. got different versions to it uh -huh. and it's something that we believe is innovative for the market yeah. and this particular one is based on the carbon fiber um, theme that you want to go for okay. a bit of a sporty feel to it but okay. light okay. and strong okay. uh, it will have dual airbags and uh, okay. full aircon which is uh, okay. which is controlled from here mm -hmm. from, from down here mm -hmm. this is where you get your the aircon from okay then um, just right about now i want to show you one of the key features of the vehicle okay which is a reverse camera so stop put it in reverse this is entry level that's what you're saying so then we see where at the back i can actually see the, the lane assist i can actually see it so we want to park into this place i don't know who's gonna come and say it's uh, on the on the parking <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm aiming for this thing it tells me oh okay, wow we are close it even tells me how close we are 1.3 meters on the right on the left we left it about 1.08 meters <laughs> then when we do this shuts off the reverse camera we go back we go forward it's okay I think we've got enough clearance. Let's see if we can line it up or not. So it even tells you how to pinpoint the car. And then we are in the bay. We are now approaching the wall. We are too close. And we stop. So this is basic basic entry level. level stuff. <laughs> we think that Africa deserves the best of what the automotive industry has. I mean, these features have been in cars but at a premium level. So why can't they be accessible to every other African at this point in time? And obviously it's got a start-stop button. Um, so key does go, I didn't see that. Yeah. So the key is actually in my pocket uh, most of the time. We don't necessarily have to, uh, to, to, or take, it, to take it out. Take it out. Just some convenient storage cubby holes for, <laughs> for that car. And back to your email, person, I think you're asking me, is this a fully African dashboard? Dashboard, yes. Even the leather seats you're sitting on, we made in South Africa. Look at, look at this, guys. Let me show yeah. you. I'll show you. I did show you the, the videos. Here's the thing that kills me. This car has got leather seats. And he said to me earlier on, and we was discussing that this car is going to be that cheap because the interleveling is going to be because they're not shipping the. They're not shipping the seat from abroad. They're actually being made here. And we're just making a funny of that if I stayed in Social Vancouver and this car has been manufactured and uh, assembled by 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 auto uh by the but just there by Rosalind where they fix uh, where they where there's some cars. I just need to pay for taxi fare and I get my share price for this car. And at 135, this car is gonna be the bomb. I don't think it, anyone is gonna stand it with those entry levels. Key let's go. I'm here to look that after this, I'm gonna actually gonna look for an entry level car that is good that's key level and that's under 135,000 or 140 even if i put it 150 i still think i can't get a new car for that for all the things with with two uh, with two, two uh, uh, airbags and with basically all the intended like this infotainment system like i can check my tire pressure it's things that you see in 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 in, in these fancy cars and this is african brand this is moreza and i'm just gonna sit down for a couple just or oh, i've already sat down at this point with the CEO, he's gonna just there's a few questions that he needs to line out to the public. Uh, then I'll catch you out, uh, guys. You've seen the inside, you've seen the interior. Thank you very much, Mr. Mr. Tatiana. This is very this this is gonna go far. Thank you very much. I, I, I'm glad I get I got to meet him. I glad I'm glad I got to meet him uh, before he became the next Bill Gates of, of Africa. So I, I'm glad I got to meet him. So guys, let's sit down. Let's see you now. Uh, this is the part where we leave the car and we go into the into the full detail of, in the vlog.